we go. And we're into the actual game. Where where she is now going to do the unlock for Tamterra Deepcroft Hard, which is the continuation of Edda's storyline. If you don't remember, this is that annoying little blue mage. Melissa, when you're talking to him, make sure you angle so you can see the chocobo handler, because there's a little secret hiding there. Oh, okay, well, hold on. I guess I need to decline then, because... Oh, here we go. Like this? That works. Okay, here we go. Uh, Payo Rayo looks as though he has seen a ghost. Seriously, that's all I'm doing. There was nothing there. Oh. No, it's coming. I'm sorry, I didn't realize it was an actual cutscene. Huh? Why, you're longing one, the famous adventurer. Thank the gods for bringing you here. <laughs> Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Payo Rayo. Uh, one of the many faceless adventurers struggling to make their way in Eorzea. Forgive me if I sound bitter. I don't begrudge you your renown. Your superiority as an adventurer was obvious to me long before you became a household name. Our paths crossed near Sestasha, you see. Hard to believe we moved in similar circles back then. Oh, this is the little chick that threw a temper tantrum. Speaking of nope, which, this is the mage of their party. Do you perchance remember having met a conjurer named Edda around that time? We used to adventure together, she and I, and two others. Our little group didn't last very long, though. She's the one that threw the temper tantrum. Things fell to pieces when Avir, our leader, and Edda's fiancé met his end in the tamped raw deep croft. Harsh words were exchanged, and we all went our separate ways. Since then, I've been getting by on my own. Truth be told, I hadn't planned on seeing any of my former comrades again, but then this letter arrived from Edda, containing an invitation to her wedding. <gasps> she gonna marry the head? Oh, tell me she's not gonna what? marry What? Okay, now keep an eye out on the chocobo handler. I am watching. Now I know what you're thinking. I should be happy for her. And I was, until I noticed the name of her groom-to-be. Do you it see it? None other than Avir. I see the, the chocobo. chocobo just walked in front of it. What's you more? can see her legs and her hat behind the sign. The venue for the ceremony is to be the Tam Tara Deepcroft. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> see? Now she's gone and the handler is confused. And now in the letter, Edda wrote that Leah Veen, that's the fourth member of our group, had already agreed to attend. They chanced to meet each other recently, from what I could gather. Yeah, while well, she was. As a reminder, Leavine is dead not because she died in the Waking Sands Massacre. Not knowing what to make of it all, I thought it wise to consult Leavine about the whole strange affair before replying. But last I heard, she joined the Scions of Seventh Dawn, and I didn't have the first idea how to go about tracking her down. Not until the greatest Scion of them all appeared, that is. You! Could you tell me where I might find her? Uh, she's dead. In a grave? <laughs> I moved her corpse. I moved her corpse. In the lichard of the Church of St. Adama Landama. Oh yeah, that's easy to say. I'm sorry, I don't... Slain? When did this happen? While the Black Wolf still lived? Then how can it be that Leavine met Edda recently? Gods, I don't know what to believe. Dude, she's marrying a dead guy. <laughs> she's nuts. If it isn't too much to ask, I would be most grateful if you'd show me Leavine's grave. We didn't always see eye to eye, but she had a good heart, and if she's truly... <laughs> Well, I need to pay my respects. Please meet me at the lich yard. Oh, great. <laughs> Quest accepted. <sighs> so, the ghost was back here? Was yeah, there. he was right there in front of the chocobo handler. Okay. It's not a ghost yet. It is not a ghost yet. It's just showing that she's following him around. So now I have to go to the grave here. Bam. Teleport. Okay, so, uh, he says, my stream is very quiet on yours. Wait. I turned it down. I'm confused. Oh, they can't hear the sound from oh, your stream. no, Niveteth logged into mine. That's what it was. He's, my stream is quieter than yours, apparently. Run! Run, <coughs> longing. Good lord, this is going to take a while. Uh, you could fly. fly. Oh, I could fly if I was smart enough to remember that I could fly, but I'm sprinting already, so <laughs> we're just going to go with this and pretend like I can't fly. How about that? Uh, uh, uh. And while you do that, I'm going to give my character a close-up and go stand on the bridge over here and do a box step, because that sounds like fun. I thought I was on the corpse here. Where is... Oh. Oops, okay, now we are gonna run or fly or whatever, because I was off by a lot. Whee! 
Okay. I'm at the grave. You ready? Here we go. I'm inspecting, interacting. I wasn't paying attention, because that's what I do. The tombstone has been knocked over and the earth before it disturbed. Hey, did you see that? That's how you spell tombstone. <laughs> Shush. So this is where poor Leavin now lies. <laughs> Still call them tombstone too. I, know. I can't even argue. Well, what's the meaning of this? The meaning of this? It's a corpse. Oh, not only is her grave defiled, her body's gone. <laughs> <laughs> who could have taken it? The crazy lady who thinks that she's. Oh my god. Oh no. Could it have been Edda? Yeah, you think? The more I think about it, the more it makes sense. I will try to explain. To the rest of us, our little party of four was but a means to riches and glory. Such things as adventure seek, but to Edda, it was her life. She blamed herself for Avere's death, and to our shame, we agreed with her. Though we knew full well we were all to blame, and then we left her where she stood with her fiancé's head for company. Her fiancé's head for company. What is wrong with you? Ack! How could we have been so heartless? Really? Head, heart? Eh, it's so funny. But what's done is done. All we can do is admit to our mistakes and make amends as best we can. She's dead. Avir is gone, and so is Levine, but Etta refused to accept it. I know not what she means to do in Tamtara, but it can lead to no good end. I will attend this, this wedding and try to restore her to her senses. Yeah, okay. I would be much reassured if you could accompany me, Longing, as Avir once did. So too does Etta look upon you, look up to you. She may not listen to me, but she may yet heed the words of someone she admires. And failing that, you'll be strong enough to kill her. No, no, don't <laughs> bear thinking about, please. If we hurry, it need not come to that. Please meet me at the Tamsara Deepcroft. Together, we'll put an end to whatever madness Etta is planning. Yes, I'd like to point out that the level 50 major escorted into Tamtara there is using... A shield. Oh, oh, wait. Something's going on. Oh, no, there's not. Never mind. Uh, now what? what? Is this... Now you gotta speak with the dude at Tamtara, and then I'll launch us into the dungeon. And this is where you had me... No, this isn't where I bound either. Hi. You had me bind in some really weird place. It has nothing to do with what we're doing here. <laughs> what? <laughs> I didn't bind you anywhere. I bound over by the dude by the bridge. <laughs> oh, that's Quarry Mill. That's the next part of the story. Seriously. Quarry Mill's where Palace of the Dead is. Okay, so this is... Okay, so how This is, is the this first dungeon happening? that you have to enter before we go into Quarry Mill. Okay. So, but your stream doesn't need to watch my screen after... This next no, week. after we finish the entire deep croft, I will be switching to my full screen stream. Wait. Instead of having my character in the corner there in G pose doing the box step. They're going to watch my stream that whole time. No, they're gonna watch us as soon as you launch it to Tam Terra, because I'm gonna watch my own stream because I need to play. Okay, you know what's funny? Uh You're lost? I see the sign for it. Yeah, oh, it's oh. underground. Yeah, I remember now. Okay. So, for anybody who's planning on actually playing this quest, you know, pay attention to the arrows next to the symbols. The down arrow means you need to go downstairs first. You're not the chick I was coming to meet. Yeah, that one. A lala fell in Thaumaturge. Just so happens a fellow like that went into the deep croft not a minute ago. That was a guy. There was a young lady <laughs> with him dressed head to toe in white. Oh boy. The lass was all smiles and giggles like a maiden on her wedding day. But your friend looked stiff as a board. Can't say I blame him, though. Crips do strange things to the best. Oh, my God. <laughs> uh, uh. Mm -mm. I'm going to be sick. Did you not realize Tamtara mm -hmm. is a crypt? I didn't think Avir was the Lalafell. No, <sighs> Avir is not the Lalafell. <laughs> so confused. Okay. <laughs> you mean to head inside as well, do you? Well, take care you don't wake the dead, eh? <laughs> like the head joke there? Nice. Okay. Now. All right. Now, I will switch to my Final Fantasy stream, and I will switch to mine. Okay. And exit G post and into group chat. Apparently, we forgot to party up ahead of time, so let me see your party invite. <laughs> we're so well prepared. We were. We had all these plans, and we didn't do any of them. Well, that's okay. I can't believe you had. <laughs> 
skip, 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 skip. I'm recording I'm sorry. this. I'm recording this so everybody can see all the dialogue. <laughs> skip I went really <laughs> slow by my standards, okay? <laughs> <laughs> but I fixed it halfway through. I just wasn't gonna go re-record all that shit. It took me like four hours. I understand. All right, well, let us launch into take care of deep craft hard. Okay. Are we doing it unsynced, or do you want to pick up two randos? If this is just the part we're rushing through, we'll just do this unsynced. We will rush through it, but you'll want to read the logs out loud as we go. That's fine. Oh my god! Which is god. why I vote. <gasps> doing Did you it see unsynced. that? Oh, you can't what? see my screen. Hold up. Hold up. I'm going to share my screen with you real quick. Do you see my screen? Yes. Look here on the right-hand side. Of the yeah, Ed as ghost oh, shadow. Okay. Yeah, and you it's see Ed that. shadow. Like, everybody's supposed to know that. I didn't notice it until just now. Whoa, what the? Oh, Rando pulled in the magic bones. You could be nice and kill it for the low i I'm trying. If I can remember how to actually kill things, that would be good. That would help <laughs> since I'm about to take you through a dungeon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But again, I'm level 80, so it's not like you really need to know how to do anything. Die. There you go. Okay, Loby, all your friends are dead. <laughs> they attacked me first. They started it. I swear. <laughs> so, how was that? I love the entrance. Ooh, until that popped up. <laughs> I loved that until the giant fly. Tim Tower looks a little different now, doesn't it? Yes. Okay. This is a little, little something. Yeah. Okay. Look, I got rid of my shield. It's invisible. We're gonna get no exp. Nope. Well, we will get poetics. You know those tombstones. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, because you really need my help. I should see it now. Come read this folio. Die. Folio. Die. Words. Die. Tom. Oh, torn folio. That makes more sense. I finally mustered the courage to speak with your hero, my love. Longing is as kind and wise as she is brave and strong. That's so nice. She listened attentively as I told her all about you. About us. Though she is a woman of few words, or perhaps because she is, everything she said seemed to inspire me. I said hi. <laughs> Why, her gaze alone instilled me with a confidence I never knew I had. Wow. Truly, I feel better prepared to face the future for having met her. How right you were, my love. Okay. Because we didn't make her crazy or nothing. Mm-mm. She was carrying around that head all on her own long before we got there. So to make sure our watchers are aware, this dungeon looks really easy because I am level 80 in it at the moment and not level 6. When you're level 6, these mobs, if you have a tank who is unexperienced, can and will wipe you. And I am level 64 and a healer who isn't actually doing any healer can healing. <laughs> I mean, technically, I can heal myself, myself as a level 80 pally. Yes, I know. You can solo everything. Oh, it's like I'm 80 and 50. Die. It wants to kill us first. That's the plan. Is there something else for me to read? I feel like I missed a folio already, but I guess I didn't. It's fun. Oh my god. Take a look. It's in a book. We were singing that song last night. <laughs> Not you and I, we. <laughs> I must have been having chat. I'm not seeing. No, I was just. I said reading is fun, and it reminded me Arizona and I were singing the Reading Rainbow song last night. <laughs> Why? Because we're nerds. I don't know. Because it's That's a fun true. song to sing. Hey, look! It's those bugs you liked so much. Demons. Want me to leave them for you? Demons wake. Not really. No, I'm good. You notice how the monsters are completely different than last time we were here? Here's one. This should be the second one. Torn folio. I could not have hoped for a more romantic first visit to Mordona. The crystals that pierced the landscape glowed in all their majesty as if to celebrate our future together. And as we lazed by Silver Tear Lake, watching the waves lapping at the shore, the sun took its leave behind the horizon, 
that we might enjoy a moment of intimacy. It's a head? <laughs> I want us to be together forever. You first said these words to me years ago, and you said them to me again tonight. I am so happy to be with you. You are fucking nuts, woman. <sighs> oh my god. Oh my god. So how are you liking Anna's story so far? She's giving me goosebumps in it's all Halloween. kinds of nasty ways. <laughs> Look, it's Levaine. Say hi to our friend. Oh my goodness. You ready for me to go kill her? Yeah. I'm gonna have to kill her slowly though, because she actually has a phase where if I overkill her, she'll wipe the entire party. Like just insta wipe. Yep. So can I dot her, or should I just let you do your thing? Uh, you can dot her if you want. There, Bam. that. What the? Heck? Now There's... you've got the fire on you. Run oh. the zombies. See, like you're gonna make all the zombies run into the fire arrows. We want to make sure our our followers and watchers see this. Okay. Um, I'm being held still, so in case the followers are wondering why I'm not doing There we go. Squat. That is Levain's attempt to help us by ta targeting the zombies. I'm not a zombie. Yes. But she's trying <gasps> to protect you from the zombies surrounding you. Treasure? Did you see what she said? No. Sorry. What did she say? Oh! Uh, I told them she was weird, but they wouldn't listen. <laughs> That's good. Oh my god, I love how the kitty cats jump. Like, what? My cat. Oh, watch. Your cat she's girl. so cute. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What are we doing? We're going to the defiled coffin, obviously. Oh my We're god. Open it. She Read the folio before we open up this. She defiled the coffin? From what I understand, defiling <laughs> something. Ugh. I'm gonna be sick. You have been looking also, interesting fact this says burst. <clears throat> Sorry. You have been looking deathly pale of late. The scorching heat of Phanalin does not agree with you. Chick Death does not agree with him. You were never fond of hot climbs, and it was a mistake to come here. Let us make for Coerthus, where the bracing air will put roses on your cheeks. No it won't. It'll just turn his corpse blue. Kidoki. <laughs> no. Are you going to do this, or should I? <gasps> ah! And we have ghosts. Oh, that's not a ghost. That is some sort of weird, horrific totem pole thing. That looks very much like... Uh, yeah, I'm going to dot you. Or you have to give me a second. Seriously. All right, so interesting fact: this is this word right here means burst. Okay, that I didn't find that one. That means and I have no, that one, and that one means whisper. That one means regly. <laughs> no, uh, Erosian <laughs> language is not quite like ours. A or B. I looked them up ahead of time. Hmm. Discarded body. Okay. This is disturbing. That thing back there, it reminds me of something off of an anime. There's a folio down here if I remember right. Okay. Plus we have to open this defiled coffin. Who who's who's anime? What's the anime? Okay. And then here's Whisper again. I know, I know. It is not easy being without a body. I promised to find one for you, but you must have patience. You are my husband-to-be, and there is nothing I would not do for you. So please, have faith in me. Give me time, my love, and I shall make you whole again, as you make me. Dude. Talk about Now we're gonna open up another defiled coffin. I see. Now that we know what she's using oh, these bodies oh, for. Oh, oh, shit. They spawned on top of me. Phantom soldier. Other phantom soldiers. Okay. That thing there. Oh my god, what is the name of that freaking show? There's an anime that has characters like that, but they only have one head. I have uh are you talking about Spirited Away? Thank you. Yes. God, that was a movie. movie? Is it an animated movie from Japan? It's still a movie, not a show. <laughs> oh, whatever. And that thing is No Face, which is a Japanese Lore. You want to go in here? We have another defiled coffin and another folio. And another folio! 
Oh, where we get to read more about this crazy lady's not so ideas. Okay, here we go. <gasps> I'm sorry to keep you waiting, my love, but we cannot afford to compromise. Not where your new body is concerned, because I want to do dirty things to it. Ordinary <laughs> adventurers die often enough leaving their ordinary corpses, but if you are to be like longing, we cannot settle for anything less than extraordinary. Oh my god. <sighs> I like them strong, but chick, seriously. But a strong body requires an equally strong soul, and since you were an asshole, I gotta find another one. As I recently discovered, <laughs> now you are probably worried that strong souls are rare, and so they are. But never fear, for we can create one ourselves. All we need is a plentiful supply of the weaker kind, and they are common indeed. Be patient just a little longer, my love, and all will be as you desire. Because I will go buy us some healing potions and... <laughs> <laughs> she she has made it to Karathis and Mordona and all of that on her own with a severed fucking head. She's a good healer by this point. Ooh, I have terror. Yes, I oh, do. So good you're I'm not terrorized by those, though. I'm just terrorized by that crazy bitch. Okay. So this so says Lord. And I think that's Demon, but I don't remember that one when I looked it up. And that one is Whisper again over there. She writes whisper and blood on the walls and runes a lot. And this one? I don't know that one. Huh. Okay. Not all of them were translatable. <clears throat> guess who the next boss is? I'm gonna guess it's her. Nope, she's the final boss. So we're not at the end. What the hell? <laughs> Did she kill him? Let's find out. He was stiff as a board when he came in, according to the guy out front. I, can't. I know. He's not dead. Oh, he's this not is the dead. actual boss down here, the spare body. <gasps> she wants to use his soul to make that evil monster. I mean, her fiancé. Yeah. I mean, technically, I think at this point she's finished making her fiancé. You think? I don't know. Oh, yeah, because she's marrying him. Duh. Puff, puff, I thought I was done for. I owe you one. I, I can't stand being here any longer. I'll see you outside. Because I'm not sticking around for crazy bitch. <laughs> you can go do that unspeakable thing to her that I really knew what I was talking about, but I didn't want to say because, you know, I felt bad about it. Yeah. There you are, Longing. Yeah. Hang on, there might With be a full ale in one of these side rooms. Slow load times. Oh, wait, what is this? I see is something there one over glowing. There? Here we go. Yeah, I thought there was one over here. With the nigh endless supply of bodies here, because it's a graveyard, I will make you well again, my love. Then we shall be wed as man and wife, and forever be joined as the gods intended. Of course, it is only fitting that a proper ceremony be held, with guests in attendance. I will send out invitations to all our friends. They will be so happy for us. I have no doubt they will jump at the chance to be... Wait. <laughs> they will jump at the chance to part with their souls? No! No, they will not! You crazy psycho! Aren't you glad Pio brought us now? Or he'd just be another dead person. Yes, I'm so glad that he brought us here to be dead. Wait. Oh, that he brought us instead of just coming on his own. Yes. Do you like these discarded eyes? Aren't they adorable? Mm -hmm. Hey, they're still better than those freaking flies. <laughs> Mostly because they're not realistic. And flies... Look, it's a soul. Goodbye, soul. Let me guess. Don't worry. There's more of them over here. It's going to go join with my ex-husband. To make. Do you remember this guy here? Pisco Demon. No. Oh! He's the guy. He's the boss from the very first run of this. The not hard version. I was say, wait. I think I do. Are oh, you gonna look. die to these guys? Flybone. Really? Am I gonna die to these guys? I better not die to these guys, because that would just be sad. Um. Oh. Oh. What's happening? About oh, to meet Etta. Boy. Here Look at her pretty white mage outfit. Is. Oh, she's a white mage now. Well, she, yep, she upgraded. Fun to be. Oh, wait. Did you notice it says Avery? The big letters? Oh, nice. No. 
<laughs> oh my god. <gasps> oh, that's just gross. That's not a body. Isn't that kind of them? <laughs> Even longing is here. Now your dream of becoming like her can become can come true. <laughs> you gonna die. <laughs> did you see that crazy face? Yes, I did. Now we have to go destroy the skull she's been carrying around. Now this right here, this is what happens when you combine um, Stockholm Syndrome and a white mage. <laughs> That's a great point. But no, let's see if I can get a look of it before we start the fight. I got remapping the realm. Yes, because it's a hard version, so it's considered remapping. Okay. So it says Avir. The big circle letters are Avir, and the rest of them are just Avir in tinier letters. Oh my goodness. <laughs> she literally just wrote Avir everywhere a million times. Do you hear that? She's crying. Her no, that's her laughing. Uh, I don't think that was her laughing. Thank you ever so much for coming to our wedding. Wait, well. Your body Your means, body the, means world the world to Avir. Hmm, where are our witnesses? The ceremony can't begin without them. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm just gonna murder his head now. This is nuts. Okay, so we're killing him first. Now she's making her wedding vows. I'm oh. trying to kill him oh, slowly, oh, but my auto oh. attack does so much damage. There's a groom-to-be coming up behind you. Oh, there's another one. They sure look like mummies, not grooms, but... <laughs> we did. Come Dang, on, I accidentally killed him. I was trying to get all of her text out. Uh-oh. You have... What? What have you done? Avir? No! Is she gonna, like, jump off the edge just because he's gone? Oh, she's gonna catch fire first. <laughs> okay. Well, at least we're being realistic with the candles. And down we go. <laughs> Why did you keep walking backwards? Oh, wait. You're crazy. Look, no, look at her face. Now she's happy. She's going to join him. And you'll notice this is one of the very few where we actually look sad at the end of a victory. Yeah. This only happens in two dungeons. This one and one that I'm not going to spoil for you. Appreciate that. Hmm. Now on to Quarry Mill so we can finish Edda's story. Because that's not where it is. Oh, goodness. Okay, so now I'm gonna exit here and then I'm gonna gate duty. My chat says duty. <laughs> I'm gonna do <clears throat> be right back for just a Wait, second. Nope, because I gotta finish this quest. Yes, that's why I'm doing be right back. So well, I can do the rest of your while you switch over quest. to mine so I can share it. Yes, I that's a fair point. Share my Thank screen. you. Mm -hmm. Ready? Go. Here we go. New cutscene, ladies and gentlemen. And we have Pyo Kylo Ren. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Pyo Rayo. It's finally over. What that could would that it could have been different. Yep, missed that. <laughs> and I need an instant replay to catch what he said. Let this be my last act as an adventurer. I've done quite enough harm as it is. I mean to go home and live out my days in... Huh? Uh. Oh, boy. Uh. No, no. It... It can't be. Whoa. Uh... Run! There you go. Ah, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. What happened? The freaking crazy bitch showed. I mean, the, the crazy chick showed up. Oh yeah, I missed this her scary face scene, didn't I? Ah, I don't know. Darn, I, I want to hear your reaction I think for that. The Lollafell's face <laughs> really was way scarier than uh, that chick's. Just saying. Okay, quest complete.